The Vortex 3X magnifier, VMX3T, is one of the best budget magnifiers on the market. It was my first magnifier, purchased back when I knew almost nothing about guns, and even less about how little I knew. But the magnifier has one big flaw, and after realizing this, I let it sit unused in storage for about two years, until just recently I fixed it. But first, briefly, a word on magnifiers. Generally speaking, magnifiers are paired with red dot sights or holographic sights, like an EOTech, and allow the shooter to get the benefits of magnification for target ID and longer shots without sacrificing the close quarter capabilities of an unmagnified red dot. They accomplish this with a flip to side mechanism that gets the magnifier out of the way when not needed with a simple flip of the wrist. And this flip to side mechanism is where the vortex falls short, at least for right-handed shooters. When it comes from the factory, the Vortex flip mount is actuated by pushing a button. For right-handed shooters, that button is easily accessible to the thumb of your left hand, but only in the flipped to left configuration. If you want the magnifier to flip right, the button is far less accessible. Now, right-handed shooters generally want the magnifier to flip right for a couple of reasons. The first has to do with eye dominance. Most modern shooters shoot with both eyes open, Right-handed folks tend to be right-eye dominant, so if the magnifier flips left, it blocks a large part of the shooter's field of view, i.e. the situational awareness coming from the left eye. If it flips right, however, it only blocks a bit of the peripheral vision. The second reason concerns slings. When your rifle hangs on a sling, you want your magnifier to flip away from your body so it is less likely to get caught up in your gear. So is the Vortex magnifier a left-handed magnifier only? I used to think so, but there is a fix. The Vortex magnifier shares a footprint with the EOTech switch to side mount. Since my EOTech G33 magnifier is mounted on a flip down Unity tactical mount, I had an extra EOTech mount just lying around. With a quick swap of the mounts using the same screws that came with the Vortex, I now have a simple flip right magnifier with a tried and true detent mechanism, no fancy buttons. With the popularity of the Unity Tactical design, spare EOTech mounts are rather common, but unfortunately, people still charge a pretty penny for them. The cheapest one I can see on TacSwap right now is $70. Still beats $200 from EOTech directly, but it's still a pretty penny. So in the end, is it worth buying a Vortex 3T just to pay extra to fix the mount? Maybe, maybe not. I like the 3T better than competing budget magnifiers like the SIG or Holosun options that I've tried. And this combo is likely cheaper than Vortex's new micro magnifier. Still, there may be more cost effective options that I have not tried. If you already have a 3T and like it, I'd keep your eyes open for one of these mounts. So there you have it. That's how I fix my problems with the Vortex 3T magnifier. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section. Thanks for watching.